Good afternoon, everyone. Um, in, last, in last year's conference, I actually spoke about the BPO industry, where it was going in the next five years, where the BPO industry was going in terms of aligning its efforts in moving up the level of quality throughout the industry. I also talked about the quality deployment that we've had in SPI Global, and I think I'll just probably do a brief review today because uh, we've had a lot of stories about deployment in the healthcare industry, manufacturing industry, and in banking as well. So what I'd like to focus on today is really focusing on the people. What happens after certification? What happens after you've deployed and you have a maturing Six Sigma or quality program? And what happens to your network of green belts, of black belts, of Six Sigma practitioners? But before I do that, I'd like to introduce again um, our company, our organization. So we are SPI Global. We are the BPO Company of the Year in 2011, given by the International ICT Organization. And we are the largest Filipino-owned BPO company across the world. We actually have 18,000 employees, most of which are in the Philippines, but we have employees across Vietnam, the U.S., and also India. We have three major lines of businesses. First of all is our content solutions. This is where we do processes that relate to publications, content editorials, um, uh, content production, and end-to-end uh, -end editorials, and similar processes. We also have our healthcare group, which is housed in the US. Um, we have several offices dealing with healthcare. Here we partner with hospitals and clinics across the US to provide services on revenue cycle management, medical transcriptions, and, and the like. And our third line of business is our customer relationship management, CRM. And this is where we house all our customer service transactions, whether these be voice, uh, email, chat sessions, SMS, and other avenues for customer service. So how did we start off with, the, with our quality deployment? Again, just a brief um, uh, run through of this. Um, I'm really proud to say that our quality champion is none other than our president and CEO, Malik Pare. Malik Pare. Something that is actually almost non-negotiable in any um, company that wants to do quality and lean Six Sigma, to have, the cha to have a champion from the top. And with that mandate, we went on and really built that commitment and value across all senior management. And it's not something that's really mandated so they must do it, but when we, when we presented that to the senior management team, we really put up a business case a business case for quality and Lean Six Sigma and why it's important for us and why it will bring in the necessary ROI. 